Our post to the Iron Bridge was shot to hell by enemy aircraft. Those ever so helpful choppers were nice enough to wait until the last second to come bail us out of that death trap. The three of us are all that's left of our company. Sergeant Torch is our driver. He never knows when to shut up. Sergeant Hobbsbaum, who never says a damn thing, mans the gun. And I'm Sergeant McKnight, the captain. Since we're all sergeants, we had to draw straws for the captain's seat. And the winner is yours truly. I'd live sweet and easy on this island for the rest of my days if I could. The Flyboys, on the other hand, are workaholics. They drove a whole mess of enemy troops off this rock. And that's why we're holed up in this damn landing ship playing five-card stud. I don't know what those Flyboys are trying to pull, but this is the worst landing operation I've ever heard of. I always knew Donnie had sticky fingers. Apparently, he was robbing banks before he joined the service. What an idiot. Come on, just hear me out. About five years ago, before I joined the military, I was digging a tunnel straight towards Grace Maria's central bank when... Donnie says the Estevakians haven't been able to get the safe open yet. He also says he dug an underground tunnel that got him within a few feet of the vault. Is this guy for real? But if he really dug a tunnel that close to the vault, I just want to know one thing. What the hell are we still doing here? Once we're back on the mainland, we've got to get to that bank before the Estevakians get their filthy paws on our loot. What do we got to lose? I'm about to go over the mission contents. Finally, the day is near. We have organized enough troops and intelligence to retake the mainland. Soon the American military will initiate an operation designed to take